All right, 83 degrees taking you on out to downtown Dallas right now. Clear skies, 83, feeling like it's 88, though. So it's a warm one out there, and it's really going to be heating up for us once again as we go through the day. So as we look at that temperature and heat index timeline as we go through the day, starting out probably just above 80 degrees here as we head towards 7 a.m. We'll see a few spots in the upper 70s, but we're going to be heating up very quickly. Look at those lunchtime temperatures up around 95 to 96, and that heat index already over 100 by then. So we're looking at a feels like temperature around 103 as we we head toward noontime coming home a little bit later today, three, four o'clock. We're going to be up around 105 to 106 for that high with that heat index pretty close to 110 and maybe even exceeding that in a few places as we head on into this afternoon. Heading toward 7 p.m. tonight, though, we're looking at 102 to 103 still with the temperature in that heat index up around 105. Even as the sun begins to go down, things finally start to cool off just a little bit. And as we head toward the end of the week, we'll see those temperatures coming down at a little bit of a break for the weekend. But we are looking at clear skies all around for today. A few showers up into the Oklahoma and uh, Texas panhandles. That's about it as far as any rain is concerned and our rain chances looking pretty slim. Even though temperatures come down, we'll have a weak front moving in over the weekend. But until then, we're looking at 104 Austin, San Antonio today. Those upper 90s close to 100 heading out toward Houston. Triple digits just about anywhere you go around the state as we go through the day in the region. In fact, with the excessive heat warnings and heat advisories for a large part of the southwest. High pressure stays in control as we go through the day today, but it begins to retreat just a little bit back to the west as we head into Thursday and Friday. Temperatures will begin to come down slightly toward the end of the week, and then as we get into late Friday, we're going to see a weak front working its way over the Red River, so that's really going to bring those temperatures down a few degrees for us, noticeably so as we get into the weekend as those winds come around out of the north and northeast, and that will give us a nice little break, at least temporarily from the triple digit heat. So we'll be in the mid to upper 90s over the weekend with that front moving through. Rain chances, unfortunately, don't look great at all for us. We were hoping for a little bit better rain chance, but right now we'll put that coverage around the Metroplex anyway, less than 20%, maybe a little bit better north and east of Dallas and Fort Worth. And you see those temperatures do start to climb once again back into the triple digits early next week.